Hello mateys, welcome back to School of Scent. I'm your host today, Captain Fragrance, and I bought every single Stronger With You fragrance, so you don't have to. Let's get into this. Now, the Strong With You line is a line of fragrances from Armani that have quite a variety of fragrances inside of the line, even though they all kind of focus on the same style of DNA, that being Gourmand. So let's start at the beginning with the original Strong With You. Now, this is a limited edition bottle that they released, I believe, in 2022-ish, 2023-ish that kind of time period, like end of 2022, beginning of 2023, that's when this version of the bottle came out, but the juice inside is the exact same as the original Stronger With You. Oh, I love this stuff. This is a very gourmand DNA and not the first gourmand. I believe that technically is Amen by Moogla. However, the first mass appealing gourmand that really took off in recent times that kind of gave way to the boom of gourmand fragrances we've had in the past few years now. It's vanillic, a little bit ambery, very sweet, and just chef's kiss, on the pun. This fragrance lasts a decent amount of time. You're getting about seven hours out of this one. With a moderate projection, it's nothing crazy. And to be honest, during the winter time, it's a perfect day today fragrance. I wouldn't necessarily wear this in summer. We'll get to something about that later. But if you wanted to, you could get away with it. Just tone the sprays down a little bit. Fantastic juice, fantastic start to the line. And I would give it probably a solid seven out of 10. Next up, we're going to talk about one of the more popular flankers from the line, Stronger With You Intensely. Now, this does what it says on the tin or what it says on the bottle. It ramps up the original Strong With You DNA and it also adds a chestnut note in there, quite a prominent chestnut note. Gives it a really winter Christmassy vibe almost. Now, this stuff is stronger. It's a bit smokier as well. This is definitely just a winter fragrance. I wouldn't rock this in summer. I'd, I'd say you could get away with it early spring when it's still really cold, but more predominantly late autumn or late fall and winter is the perfect time for this. Performance in, on this is better than the OG, at least on me. About 10 hours we're looking at, 10 hours performance, strong projection on this one, strong to moderate for life. And it's just incredible. The coloration of the juice on this one, just something I really, really adore. It's more that ambery browny color, almost like liquidized sugar. And that is a really good summary of it. It is sweet, it is loud, it is a bit nutty. And mm, banger, banger flanker, banger flanker. <laughs> Solid flanker, and I'd give this one an eight out of 10. 32% of people who watch School of Scent are subscribed to us. If you guys wanna see our channel grow, to really help us out, click subscribe. Let's get that number to 40%, thank you. Now going from one that is predominantly for the winter to one that actually was marketed and designed to be worn in the summer, Strong With You Freeze. First things first, the frosted glass on this bottle, I adore. I think it just, I, I, I really like frosted glass. I'm, I'm starting to understand that if a bottle is a frosted glass bottle, I, I'm drawn to it. Something about it, I just, I really enjoy it. This is really good. It takes that original Strong With You DNA that we're working with, that vanillic, slightly ambery gourmand scent profile. It adds a citrus burst at the beginning. It freshens it up. This is fantastic juice. This works really well in the summer. And you're looking about seven hours performance on this one with again, a moderate projection. Now. At the time of recording, I do believe this one is now discontinued, which is a damn shame because it was absolutely phenomenal stuff. They have brought out something to replace what this was designed for. However, that one we'll get onto later. This, if you can find it to try it, I would highly recommend you try it, but it's not, it's not the easiest thing. However, this was a fantastic release. This is a great summer gourmand. There are very few summer gourmands to pick from at least good ones. <laughs> and this is just a, a citrusy, 
sweet, a bit like a lemon drizzle cake or a lemon tart. It's not too lemony and it is more gourmand cake-like, but it's that sort of like light fluffy gourmand cake-like vibe, if that makes any sense. <laughs> But yeah, Stronger With You Freeze, I would also give. In fact, no, this one I'd put higher. I'd give this one an 8.5 out of 10. I was gonna say eight out of 10, but no, this gets an 8.5 out of 10. This is marginally better than the Intensely, at least in my opinion. Now, Stronger With You already had a winning DNA in terms of its vanillic, ambery, warm, chestnutty vibe. And what makes that better, at least to me as an ex-bartender, is Boozy Note. That's where Strong With You absolutely comes in. The rum note in this is fantastic. Now in the fragrance community, the fragrance world, you'll often get the terms niche quality thrown about every now and again, along with things such as beast mode. Now, what is niche quality? That is a completely separate topic, a completely separate video, but to simplify it, it's more unique. When something is focused on a niche, it's targeting a very specific area or a specific market and in terms of a niche quality product this is leagues above most designer releases the rum note that they've added into the strong with you dna just sets it apart from anything else in the line and the longevity on this is 12 plus hours i've gotten about 14 15 hours out of this before most definitely i would say this is similar to intensely in terms of when i would wear it being late fall late autumn or winter predominantly. However, this is something that I do just sometimes pick up and wear whenever because I like it that much. As you can see, it's got a little bit of a dent in it. Not a massive dent, but a little bit of a dent compared to the rest because it is my favorite. I am a little bit biased towards this one. Fantastic bottle design as well with the ombre effect. I love an ombre effect. I love frosted glass and I love ombre effects. Like, who knew? And me being a pirate or a captain, Rum, it just, it, it's match made in heaven really, isn't it? So, strong with you, absolutely. I would genuinely give a 10 out of 10. Fantastic fragrance from the line. And if you can only get one strong with you, this is the one I would point you in the direction of. Now we're into the territory of harder to come by strong with yous, more predominantly the Middle Eastern exclusives from the line. Now, much like the Middle Eastern exclusives from the Dolce and Gabbana, the one line, such as Luminous Night, Mysterious Night, and Royal Night, you can find them here and there from time to time, but they are very difficult to source. They're much easier to find in the Middle East where they were originally marketed and launched. Now, the first one we're gonna talk about is this bad boy right here, Stronger With You Oud. It's, it's quite simply a perfect bottle design. Black and gold is a phenomenal color combination when you apply it to absolutely anything so this enables that on the head. Performance on this, 12 plus hours. I expect nothing less from an oud based fragrance. Whether or not it's real oud, I'm not too certain. I'm doubtful because it's not really in the, the price range of real oud. It's a bit more expensive than the other Stronger With Yous, but it's still not sort of real oud price. So it probably is a synthetic oud fragrance, but it's a synthetic oud done correctly. It takes those gourmand aspects, that vanillic, amber, vibe that Strong With You, the entire line has, adds in a lovely, smoky, slightly sweet oud. This isn't a, an alemannic oud. This isn't a fecal oud. This is a sweet, smoky oud that complements those other notes perfectly. This adds that Middle Eastern spin on the DNA and it does it to perfection. Again, another 10 out of 10, in my opinion, from the Strong With You line, another 10 out of 10 strong projection on this one. By the way, if I didn't mention strong projection, super strong projection on absolutely. <laughs> but yeah, strong projection from Strong With You Oud and oof, cracking addition to the line, cracking fragrance. Another Middle Eastern exclusive one from the Strong With You line is Strong With You Leather. Now this is an all gold bottle, not real gold. Fingerprint magnet, that's the that's the problem with gold bottles. You get your fingerprints all over it, you're cleaning it almost every other day. But in terms of the actual fragrance, the actual scent profile, again, incredible. Vanilla, amber, you've got those sort of, that nuttiness that Intensely has is a little bit in here, but you also get the addition of a smooth leather. Again, much like Oud, this isn't an animalic leather. This isn't that sort of like dirty leather that some fragrances have. This is a much more refined leather. Think ombre leather from Tom Ford, 
that smoothness, that's the kind of leather note that you'll find in Strong With You Leather. This one has got a little less performance than the Oud, about 10 plus hours, it's still fantastic, but a little less than the Oud, ver uh, the Oud Flanker. And projection on this is still strong. Again, I love the bottle, even though it is a fingerprint magnet and it makes another fine addition. And also kind of started a trend. Strong With You Oud could have been a one-off, Strong With You Leather, signaled the fact that they were, these Middle Eastern flankers were gonna be focusing on specific notes in addition to the Strong With You DNA. Now, after the sad discontinuation of Strong With You Freeze, rest in peace, my dearly beloved flanker. We were graced, I suppose is a, an interesting word to use, maybe not the correct word, with Strong With You Only. Now, this is another take on that fresher, lighter version of Strong With You. It's still got that vanillic ambery aspect to it, but toned down a lot. And it's still got the citrus that Freeze had, but also toned down a lot. This is quite frankly, the Diet Coke of the Strong With You line. No one really likes it. <laughs> Where Strong With You Freeze was the Coke Zero or the Pepsi Max, and Strong With You is the OGs. Strong With You only is the diet versions. It's just, it's not really memorable. It doesn't do anything interesting. And Freeze was a better version of what this is trying to be. So we lost a good one and we got a mediocre one to replace it. I didn't mention, but retrospectively, Strong With You Leather gets a 10. This gets a three. This gets a three out of 10. I don't care if that's harsh. Genuinely, they should have just kept Freeze around. This, this is a miss from the line, in my honest opinion. Projection on this is all right, it's moderate, moderate to soft even, and longevity. I get six hours maximum out of this, which is unfortunate because Freeze did better. I know, I'm going on a lot about Freeze. Freeze was great, what can I say? <laughs> Strong with you only. I wouldn't recommend picking this one up personally. I have it. Would I buy it? Would I rebuy it? No, eh, Strong with you only. If only we could forget it. Hey. <laughs> now we come to the penultimate fragrance in the line, which is Strong With You Amber, another Middle Eastern exclusive. However, this one I do believe is still available to be found in Harrods or Harrods Beauty in the UK at least. So it's not as hard to find or come by as the other Middle Eastern exclusives were when they came out, but it is still not readily available in all fragrance outlets and stores that you'll find. This one, if you have Strong With You Intensely, I think this is redundant. Does this do that better? Yes, this is better than Strong With You Intensely. Only marginally, but it is better. But only because this focuses on the amber in the line. It tones it up. It gives it sort of that spicy, ambery nature that you get when you have like a deep, deep amber note. And it doesn't quite have that chestnutty vibe to the same extent as Intensely does. So Intensely is more chestnut heavy. This, like it says on the bottle, is more amber heavy, but this is basically Stronger With You Intensely for all intents and purposes. If you don't have Intensely, would I recommend this one over it? Yes. Is it more expensive than Intensely? Yes. Is it harder to find than Intensely? Yes. Is it that much better than Intensely? No, not really. But far fewer people are gonna be rocking Stronger With You Amber than they will Stronger With You Intensely. So if that matters to you, this might be the one to check out. I'd give this a nine out of 10. It's not quite up there with the rest of the Middle Eastern exclusives, but it's still interesting. In terms of the chronology of the Strong With You releases, this one was a bit of a redundant release, unfortunately. Oh, and projection is moderate, longevity about nine hours. And finally, we have Strong With You Tobacco, which is the most recent release from the Strong With You line, another Middle Eastern exclusive. This one I haven't procured a full bottle of just yet because it's almost impossible to get here in the UK. However, I have got a little sample of it here and hopefully we can stick a picture somewhere on screen or, you know, a nice graphic of what Strong With You Tobacco looks like. It's very similar to Strong With You Amber, to be honest, it's a bit of a deeper red in terms of the coloration, but same bottle design that the Strong With You line has always had with the gold strips on it, but more deep red color. This breaks the scale. This is the best release they've done. However, this is the most divisive release that they've done. Some people really don't like this one. 
I really enjoy this one. It depends how much you enjoy the note of tobacco and the complexities of the note of tobacco. You've got varying different tobacco notes within the fragrance world. You can have smooth ones, green tobacco, piped tobacco, cherry tobacco, smoky, sweet. There's so many different facets to tobacco notes in the fragrance world. It depends how much you enjoy all of those different facets. I'm a massive tobacco note lover in terms of fragrances and this is great. It's a spicy tobacco, a little bit of a smoky tobacco, but predominantly a spicy, almost herbaceous tobacco note that they've put in with that Strong With You DNA. So you get the gourmand aspect, you get that vanillic, ambery warmth that Strong With You has, and then you get a spicy, herbal vibe to it. Great projection on it. We're talking moderate to strong, and fantastic performance. I get 10 to 12 hours out of this one. I would give it a 15 out of 10, just because I love tobacco. Uh, <laughs> we're gonna give it a Captain Fragrance made up rating. So here we go, drum roll please. We're gonna give it a Pirate out of 10. <laughs> it's, it's great. Strong With You Tobacco is great. I might make this my scent of the day when I'm recording this. But yeah, Strong With You Tobacco, 10 out of 10. And that's the end of the line. So that's been a little rundown of the entire Stronger With You fragrance line. I bought them all so that you don't have to. Hopefully this video will help you pick or decide which one you want to go for if you're considering going for them, or just give you a little exploration, little tour of the line itself so you can see what it's about, what kind of things it offers. I hope you enjoyed this. I've been the captain. You've been awesome as always. And with that, I'll catch you lot on the flip side. Adios.